Hi, we are the Varga family. We thought because we haven't said hi or anything for a really long time, we've not been able to send an update. Uh, we thought we'd like to do it this way, kind of a video blogging or something. So uh, we really hope that uh, this is going to be <laughs> exciting for you, as it is for Yasmin already, and uh, hope you enjoy. Uh, our reports from the last few few months. Let me introduce to you Yasmin. She's a good girl. So we love her so much and we love the opportunity uh, <laughs> that we can learn from God through her. Mm. I'm learning a lot because I'm at home with her uh, all, the, all day long and uh, uh, mostly I have to learn how to be patient and loving and how to not worry about things uh, about her and yeah it's an everyday walk and lesson and I love it because it hurts uh, but otherwise I wouldn't be able to learn this only through her. So we are very thankful for her and our prayer is that that she would uh, get to know God as soon as she can. We already told her the gospel so we'll see what will happen. <laughs> well, any. As it is. That's all. <laughs> So I'd like to talk to you about our church. Um, as, you, as you've heard me or read my reports, I've been writing about the fact that I, I'm a, an elder in the local church. And recently the Lord's given me the opportunity to preach uh, numerous times. So it's the ministry of the Word of God that has been very important and has been taking up a lot of our time in the ministry. It's my job to schedule speakers for our church, and previously I didn't want to schedule myself too often because I thought it would be something, you know, boastful. But the Lord's been leading us, really changing my heart about this, and leading us to just go ahead and, you know, if I have the opportunity, let's take it and let's preach. And so I have, and that has been quite a challenge uh, to preach the Word of God. At the same time, I teach at the local church's little house Bible study group that uh, meets every Wednesday evening. Uh, I'm not the only one, but I'm one of the two uh, elders who teach. So as you see, as you can tell, it's basically a lot of teaching, a lot of preparation time. I'm preaching to Yasmin every day, by the way, sharing a Bible story, even though she doesn't understand anything. So it's preaching, preaching, preaching all the time. But that's good. Before Yasmin was born, uh, I wrote some new songs and uh, we started to work on it. But then Yasmin came and suddenly everything was changed. Um, I couldn't finish everything, but we would like to uh, finish and record these new songs. So we are still working on it. I tried to finish my part before she was born and I gave to a guy who started to make, uh, arrange the music for it. Uh, and our plan is to finish it uh, around Christmas time. Uh, hopefully we, we will be able to record the songs during the summer. Uh, I would like to encourage. Uh, the people with those songs that I wrote because uh, they are about my life and what I've learned before Yasmin so we we need your prayer for this because uh, uh, obviously without God uh, we cannot do anything I wouldn't be able to uh, write a song uh, and uh, and also we are praying for get enough uh, uh, money for it we we will be able to start it we have a little money for that but 
it's it's much so much more so we are praying that if it's God's will uh, then we would have the right amount and we can start uh, recording the studio okay um, as I wrote to you in our uh, previous update I am Dean of Students in the Bible School that started this fall so that's a new thing for me to uh, to be doing that uh, that is another challenging thing uh, because right now I'm in a position where I'm basically the it's kind of hard to focus so I'm basically the one in charge of our students of course I have bosses many of them but um, I have to be the one who makes the final decision in most situations and that is very challenging actually I have a great team of course uh, of uh, another three people on the Dean staff and that is really good you've I've written a lot about Monza who's Dean of Women and uh, she's of course a very dedicated girl in charge of the women so that's good and uh, and then a new couple on our staff is uh, Timmy and uh, Randall Stone. Uh, they've you've both you've heard about both of them, but now they're new as a couple on our staff, and they are. She's assistant dean of women, and uh, he is our uh, dean of men. So with these three, it's it's a great team of deans <laughs> counseling our students. Yeah, there you go. So lots of ministry opportunities among our students. We have uh, students from eight or nine different countries, Canada, America, uh, uh, a lot of people from Germany, Hungary of course, and so that's quite an opportunity to teach them. Not only of course deal with problems, but uh, teach them through the Word of God, chapels, uh, room devotions, group devotions with just guys and girls. Lots of preparation once again for messages and for devotions, but that's good. That is good. And uh, we're going through a lot together. Of course, one-on-one -on -one counseling, that also keeps us busy. Of course, I can't tell you much about that because it's very private. But that's what really takes up a lot of our time. So that's typical of a counselor's work that uh, you do a lot of work, but you can't tell anyone about it because it's all personal. But uh, we enjoy it. That is also teaching us a lot. My wife is playing with the kid over there, so it's hard to focus, but it's okay. So anyway, so that's, I think that's enough for you to hear right now about uh, me being the Dean of Students. So, thanks once, once again for taking the time to watch this. Hope it was an encouragement for you all. Uh, Yasmin definitely enjoyed it. We had to run around the house to keep him, I mean to keep her calm. But, uh, yeah, so enjoy uh, this new year. May God bless you. We're hoping to keep in touch with you a lot more regularly than in this last year. Uh, we'd like to do that like we did the year before when we could get in touch with you almost every month. Uh, possibly give you a couple of these video uh, updates and um, read about what's going on in our lives. So thank you very much. God bless you. again. Majd látni. <gül> <gül>